Hi, this is Shiva Rajaya from vitalcoaching.com and we are talking about vital sex and the topic for this video is free your sexual energy. Let's put back sexual energy into context on a planetary level. You might have heard that said from me before. Right now, how we use our sexual energy as a human race is not really optimized. If I had to give a mark right now on the level of performance of how we use sexual energy as a human race, between 0 and 100%, I would say that we are at 20% in optimization. It means lots of traumas, lots of dysfunctional behaviors, lots of porn, lots of uh, frustrations, lots of uh, deprivation, you know, people who would like to have more sex in their life but don't know how to access it, uh, lots of frustration, lots of, you know, rape, lots of uh, suppression around sexual energy. So basically, we live in a, in a world where, you know, lots of people are, are quite frustrated about their sex life. And, uh, you know, many people have been traumatized in their childhood through sexual or emotional abuse, and uh, so all that, I would say, enough. We had enough. As a human race, we need some solutions here. And uh, I want to really make a call here to the invisible, to the force that are watching us out there, you know, no matter what you call these forces, whether it's the universe or more personified gods, it doesn't matter. That's a call to the universe, to the invisible, please. We need help here. As a human race, we are doing our best, but we need some serious power kick here, some serious power boost and some serious help. As far as, you know, many areas are concerned, respecting the environment and so on and education. There are lots of areas where we can uh, develop higher skills and perform way better, but sex is one, one of them. Right now, it's, it might be working individually, like my sex life is working good for me, but I can see out there, there is lots of, you know, lots of, uh, lots of trouble, lots of pain, lots of dissatisfaction around this field. So, you know, when we talk about freeing your sexual energy, what I mean is this. It means that sexual energy inside of you is an unlimited source of power, energy, bliss, that can circulate throughout your whole system and totally activate your chakras and put you in a state of beautiful, blissful trance anytime. So the reason why it's not spontaneously happening right, right now is because the energy, the sexual energy has been locked and blocked through, educa through education, through practices that are not necessarily uh, positively enhancing your sex life. So when we talk about vital sex, the goal is this. The goal is to free your sexual energy, to give you a sense of sexual mastery. And by freeing your sexual energy, it doesn't mean going around having tons of sex with unlimited partners, you know, in a chaotic way. That's not what it means. Freeing your sexual energy means that your sexual energy is free in your system and you are free to use it in whatever way, shape or form you want. If you are into uh, polyamory and having multiple partners, that's your choice, that's fine. If you are married and uh, with a steady partner, you still want your sexual energy to be free. You still want to open channels uh, there that are going to honor this very secret source of power and bliss inside of you, but it doesn't stay locked in your system and creates all these sicknesses and dysfunctions that you might be observing in your life right now. So the idea of sexual freedom is that, you know, it's exactly that. Free your sexual energy, free your sexual power and create uh, in your life a relationship with that, uh, that energy which is extremely harmonious. So this means also changing very often your sexual conditioning. Because sexual conditioning in society, in our modern world, is based a lot on guilt and shame. You know, if you go to somebody and say, pleasure is good, I love my sex life. Yesterday I had this fantastic orgasm and I was filled with beauty, joy and bliss. I feel like I touched God, I touched something that was so profound. You know, if you start having this conversation with uh, somebody, most of the time it's going to make your audience a bit uncomfortable. Why? <laughs> you know, why is that? 
we we come from sex this is we were born out of the sexual act so why is it that suddenly there is this shame and guilt around sex around nakedness around sexual practices you know if you see a couple kissing in a public place what's your energetic reaction to it do you feel like oh my god i cannot look at it or do you want to look at it or you feel jealous what is your energetic reaction to it which is a symbol of how you feel about your sex life in general so the idea of freeing your sexual energy means removing the blockages, removing the hurts, removing all these patterns that not necessarily serve you. Yeah. Having a bit of guilt or shame here and there uh, might be useful sometimes if you are engaging into something that is criminal. <laughs> you know, but using your sexual energy is not, is not a crime, at least in most countries around the world. Yes, in some countries it is. It is a crime. It is something that can be even punished if it's outside of, of marriage, for instance. So, but to go back to the individual, what is in the sphere of your own personal space and in your sphere of what you feel internally, it's like, I want to encourage you to look at your sexual energy as a source of life force, which is sacred. Bring back the divine in there bring back a sense of respect and honor and gratitude for having this force inside of you and then when you start engaging with somebody do it from a place of awareness and consciousness add some skills some talents to it it's time to break the patterns that have been limiting you for an extended period of time so again Give yourself a mark, you know, between zero and 100%. How sexually free are you? And again, this is not an invitation to go and have sex with whoever, you know, in multiple forms with different partners. No, it's not that. It's your sexual energy inside of you. How free is it? When you are having sex with your partner in a committed relationship or in marriage, is your sexual energy freely flowing? Is it activated? Are you having fun? Are you having a good time? Are you thinking about something else? Are you turned on? Are you excited by what's happening? You put it into a bigger perspective. How much satisfaction do you get out of that between zero and 100%? Okay, these are the core ideas. Free your sexual energy. I want to free my sexual energy. That's your mantra for right now. Test it, try it, see if it resonates with you. If it does, Go for it. You have an avenue here of exploration that you can tap into. Have fun with that. I'll see you soon.